You're watching the LASIK Minute with Dr. Khanna. Today we'll, we will be discussing dry eyes. So as we have mentioned before, dry eyes is when the eye does not have enough tears to keep the eye moist and leads to symptoms like grittiness, redness. One of the causes of dry eyes is blepharitis or lid margin inflammation. Where the lashes grow from, we have tear uh, uh, glands and oil glands. When these get blocked, then you can get dry eyes. Um, this is more common when people have inflammation, like even in thyroid diseases, disease or other disease like trachoma, etc. So if we can identify blepharitis, which your eye doctor can do by noting the signs of vascularization, mebomitis, and lid surface uh, irregularity, we can then focus our treatment towards that. So a couple of products have been invented and I do, I'm not endorsing any product but this is a very nice lid scrub for minor uh, lid uh, margin inflammation where you can uh, rub the eyelid and it'll take off the scum from the lid edge so the oils and the fluids can flow again. It's a good idea to do a warm compress before that so that the warmth can melt everything inside the glands and then the scrubbing can remove it. For more extensive disease, uh, there is a medicated scrub from the same company and this one you just leave it in the eye overnight. Now what if somebody has extensive uh, blepharitis which is not responding to topical um, therapy with the scrubs and drops? So some patients we might even prescribe uh, antibiotics like doxycycline which helps in changing the consistency of the secretions of the eye and helps fight the blepharitis. Now somebody came up with a good idea and I give a tribute to this company Ocusoft where they've put in the medicine, the scrubs and some spray to help with it in a box to make it convenient for people with blepharitis. So if you have got blepharitis or severe red eyes and your lids margins always red, consult with your eye doctor and see if one of these treatments might be best for you. Thank you.